Hi everyone, okay, why do I always say okay when I start a video, I don't know, but okay, um, it's Saturday, so I went to Slimming World this morning, and I got weighed, and uh, a wee bit first about the week, this week actually went alright, I stuck to plan, I planned out my meals last Sunday, and I made them, now I always have a cheat day on a Saturday, always have a cheat day on a Saturday um, I've done it on I've always done it on, it on any diet that I've done I think um, it's proven you know if you if you keep going with all or nothing attitude you're, it's, at some point you're going to be like do you know what I've had enough so I think if you have a cheat day I do it once a week some people do it once a fortnight I don't go nuts on it um, I have a treat now today I had I got well, I'll tell you what I done. I got weighed, I went down and I lost three pounds. Absolutely delighted. Honestly, I could have absolutely hugged her. Um it was amazing. So I got my first stone award and I also got under the 14 stones. So I am now weighing 13 stone, 13 and a half pounds. So I started at 15 stone, so I'm at 13 stone, 13 and a half pounds. So I think that's all right. That's been in four weeks week lo weight loss because the first week you get weighed, obviously you don't lose, you don't know. You, that's just your weigh-in week. So it's really been four weeks weight loss. Um, so, yeah, I am absolutely over the moon with that. So my next um, goal is to get to 12, 12 and a half for Christmas. Now there's five more weigh-ins before Christmas so that would be about two and a half to three pounds every week which I think is doable if I stick to plan um I just think I'd like to get under that 13 stone barrier because it would mean I could have a wee bit more leeway like on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day Christmas Eve I'm having my all the kids down like my two daughters and their families Plus me, Paul and Kane, we're all staying, we're all have been here, we're not staying, I'm having like a wee Christmas Eve party for all the kids, um, I'm going to make a big buffet and we're going to have like Christmas sing-along musics and you know Christmas movies and things in the background, so I'm going to do that, so I'd like to be able to eat the buffet you know without thinking of, but so that is my goal, I want to lose another stone in five weeks which I think honestly I do think I can do it, if I don't, as long as I get as close to it as possible so today, like I was saying, after um, I came home and things after group, I had Ellison staying last night, my granddaughter, and I went up to my other daughters and I got a McDonald's as my treat this week. I got a double cheeseburger. Um, I actually bought two double cheeseburgers and a large fries. And I ate the first double cheeseburger. I don't get it with anything on it, I just get it plain. Um, first double cheeseburger and half the chips and felt really full. Um, but when I came home, I ate the other burger. But then, about half an hour after that, I got really bad diarrhoea. Now, I've got, I think I've got a touch of IBS anyway because I really get, well, they said, when I went before, they said it wasn't IBS. They said it was, um, I've got a, what do you call it? It's like an overactive bill, but there's a name for it. I can't remember. I can't remember. But it means basically, once I have something to eat, I, I get diarrhoea quite a lot. Um, but today, honestly, I don't know if it's because I've not been eating any fatty foods or anything. It really reacted to me and I had really bad diarrhoea for about an hour solid. And then I had to go to bed and go and lie down. I didn't, really didn't feel well. I felt drained. So I think next week, what I've learned is instead of having like fatty foods for a treat, I'm going to have like, I don't know, something that I've fancied. Maybe a bit of chocolate or maybe some cheese and no count it. I know cheese is a fat food, but do you know what I mean? But I don't think I'm going to have like a, like a McDonald's or anything like that because the junk food absolutely killed me the day. So I've learned that. In a way, that's good because my body's getting used to not having it. Now, with regards, look at the hair. Guys, this is driving me insane. Look at it. There's nothing I can do. It's just, ooh, I told you it would go like this. I'm so tempted to shave it. It's driving me nuts, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Um because it's like this because um 
like I said, I went to bed. It is sticking right out. When I said it last week as well, but when I do go to, like, if it's like this, I'll not go out with it like this. I'll either put the hairband in it or I'll put my, luckily it's cold outside and I put my woolly hat on. But when I go to uni during the week, what I'm doing is straightening it all, putting my score mark here and then putting something over so that it hides it. But I wanted to show you, because obviously I'm, I'm documenting it growing, but oh my God. I'm like a porcupine. Seriously, like a human porcupine. Okay, with regards to the weight loss, I do notice that I've lost a bit of weight in my face, I think. My cheekbones are getting a bit more, you know, my face isn't as puffy. And definitely, I don't know if you can see it for the side in this light, but my double chin has went away a lot. Seriously, a lot. That was like hanging down. So definitely that. Now, I should have done this for week one and I never ever gave it a thought. I'm going to give you a full side profile. I don't know if you can see me. This is my side profile. You'll see with my top on, I've got humps and bumps. I am a size 16. I've got humps and bumps on the back. And humps and bumps on the side. Oh, sorry if that camera's going a bit daft because of the light. If I lift this up here, you'll see I've got a tummy. I've not really got that much of a big bum, but I've got fat here and round here. So I want to lose all of this and obviously the weight on my arms and things as well. So I'm going to maybe show you this once a month and document how much it's going down. And we will see. But anyway, this is what I look like at 13, 13 and a half. I'm listening to my floorboard squeaking. So yeah, over the moon anyway, that was my £3 off today. Um, so I just need to keep going, just keep going and keep going and keep going. Tonight... Uh, well, because this has been my cheat day, I haven't. I don't count anything today. But I've made the Slimming World um, kebab, just pork meat, beef mans. It's all under five percent stuff. It's free, so I've, I'm going to put that in the oven. I don't know what it's like, but I had it chilling overnight because you've got to leave it in the fridge. Um, I've got all my chicken and everything all ready for this week. So I'm hoping again for a really good weight loss this week. So thank you so much. Please again, let me know how you all got on this week with your weight loss. Honestly, oh my gosh, honest to goodness, I've got another hair dye, I'm going to dye it probably tomorrow as well, look, imagine if I went out wet like that, no, I've got to cover it up, and it doesn't even stay down, so even if I wet it or put anything on it, look at just, watch this, whoops, whoop, oh my gosh, anyway, let me know how you got on down in the comments box, guys. And thank you so much for following me and for all the encouragement that you guys have given me every week. It's been amazing. And, um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you all again soon. Bye-bye.